We are going to calibrate the scanner 85 x Messi bus. For that, we need two resistors, one of 100 ohm, and other 122 ohm. I did not have a resistor of 122, so I uh, combined two resistors of 122 ohms in series. So it becomes 122 ohm. And uh, for that, we have a formula to calculate the temperature from resistor. For PT100, which is TC is equal to RC minus 100 upon alpha into 100, and uh, at 122, we should get 57.6 degrees Celsius temperature at the scanner. This is the back plating card. Now I'm going to connect both resistors on two different channels to show you how to calibrate Messi bus scanner. I have connected two resistors at two different channels. At channel 1, I have connected 100 ohm resistor. You can see this is the common wire and this is 100 ohm resistor. At channel number 2, I have connected 122 ohm resistor. This is the common wire and this is, these are the series resistor 122. So now I am going to connect the spec plate to this scanner. As you can see, the black plate is connected to the scanner. And now, channel 1 and channel 2 are not blinking. It shows that they are connected in the system. Now we are going to check the values for that. Put it on manual. X, 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 1. It should give uh, 0 value as we have connected the register of 100 ohm at channel 1 and 78 is in channel 2. It should give 57.6 as per our calculated value, but it's showing 78.1. So we need to calibrate this. So now I'm going to show how to calibrate this. First of all, press VFI. Then using up key, come to CNFG configuration and then ENT it is asking for password here it is 0 as our password so I am pressing enter again ENT now it is showing in no 8516 here you can change the channels which you want to use we are using 16 channel here so I am not changing it I am going directly into calibration mode for that you have to press SCN time then it is showing IPCLCH, you have to press enter and then next, now you have to select the channel. I have connected 100 ohm register at channel 1, so I am selecting it at channel 1 by pressing ENT and then pressing next you will see the value. Now you can change this value to whatever you want. Here in our condition we have to set it on 0 as we have connected a register of 100 ohm here. Zero and then press ENT again. It is showing bad. So the zero calibration has been successfully completed. Now we have also uh, we have to change the calibration on full our, our calculated value which was 57.6 and for that I have connected register at channel 2 of value 122 for that I will go back and then again CNFG press enter scan time IPCL uh, press enter and then next and then I will select channel 2 press enter select next then what was the value, the calculated value is 57.6, I will input value 57.6 here and then press ENT again. So the calibration has been successfully completed and zero and full. You can check the value as 57.7 is the real time value. 
can see the register somewhere. Now you can connect RTD and use it as you want for your temperature alarm and tripping check.